Baltimore Charm on LFL Football Night. Kickoff is next. Now it's Morgan Spencer in the driver's seat as we get this game underway in the fifth anniversary of the LFL in the U.S. That is T.C. Mesta. Over from the 19-yard line, Spencer under center, a little misdirection handoff. That goes to T.C. Mesta getting on the outside edge. All the way to the... Mesta has to step up and have a huge game to take the heat off of Morgan Spencer. And there is a first down handoff to T.C. Mesta. Was the LFL Defensive Player of the Year. A huge season for Purnell at strong safety, and that is Allie Dickey on the left side again. In goal here for Baltimore. Ball at the nine of Jacksonville. Fake handoff. Morgan Spencer going to the right, running out of real estate. Ow. Neither one of these two teams are going to back down. That is Dina Wajowski. The back at the Jacksonville 14. Another fake handoff. Spencer looking to the back of the end zone, going to try the left side, and that is Savannah Dickey. Key play early in this game. Inside handoff this time to Heather Hudson, who had some clearance, but that is Lawrence. There are no field goals in the LFL. Every possession is four down territory. There's a handoff to Katie from the three, so they're going to go for a two-point attempt here. Spencer under center, scrambling right, going to try that right side. That is Lawrence Ziegler in motion. K.K. Matheny inside handoff, fake to Steinmetz, looking down the field. That is to need to step to the next level and take this team to a championship. Now a second and ten play, handoff to Stage Steinmetz. Steinmetz on the right side. Now K.K. Matheny under center. Ball at midfield, there's the handoff to Sage Steinmetz, trying the right side, now cutting to the left side. Steinmetz right now is a wicked, dirty running back. She's running all over Baltimore. She's like a bus driver. And the shotgun, looking over the defense, high snap. Gets her feet underway in an easy pitch and tough. against Jacksonville. The do mix, they went right down the field on the opening drive, and then Jacksonville answered, and they did the same thing on Baltimore. It's a great game so far. And there is T.C. Mesta, not able to get to the outside. That is your first-year coach. Obviously, Damon Jones, the former Jaguar, has taken over in Jacksonville. And that is the first-year running back for Baltimore, Adaya Oshikoya. 7-6 now with Morgan Spencer under center. Stop this girl. Dropping back, looking to the left side to Ali Dickey. Two receivers split right now, one in motion. Inside handoff, double reverse. And that is Allie Dickey again. As she is under center now in the pocket. Checking to her receivers. Now just a little dump off to TC Mesta. And Mesta breaks to the left side. And hits Mesta out of the backfield. All the safeties drop back. Mesta checks down, nobody's underneath. Great play by Morgan, let the safeties drop. Tried the two point attempt again from the three yard line. Morgan Spencer dropping to the right side, going to try to run it in. Now finds Allie Dickey. Now Jacksonville taking over. That is Sage Steinmetz once again breaking into the open and still 100%. Now from the shotgun, Matheny to Renda. And Renda just can't get her. Second in goal now from the Baltimore 7. Matheny inside handoff from the shotgun and Steinmetz. Third and goal handoff. This one to Ziegler. And Lauren Ziegler feet. Fourth and goal shotgun. Matheny over the middle. That was intended for Adrian. Morgan Spencer goes back to work. A first and ten from the Baltimore three. Back in the pocket. Gonna look down the field. First and goal from the one. Shotgun snap. That one handoff to Sage Steinmetz. And Steinmetz on the left. Now Jacksonville for the extra point attempt. They're going to go nobody in sight. And that one. Or change of possession, but not against these safeties. Now a first and ten handoff to TC Mesta. Nothing doing. And, and let's play in the second half. And this should be the last play of the half. Morgan Spencer looking down the field. Nothing. And is Jacksonville's dominating up front. Next tonight. TC Mesta, solid. But let's see how she plays in the second half. And Spencer will get us underway here with the kickoff. That is Ziegler deep to return. She's going to bring it out, out to the five at about the ten. Still fighting. And Motors to about as well. Now a first and ten for Jacksonville. And there's a handoff to Steinmetz on the left side, finding a lane and getting to the outside. It's now a first and goal from the ten. Matheny in the shotgun again. Another inside handoff to Sage Steinmetz, this time on the right side. There's the snap to Matheny, fakes the handoff. 
Scrambling now to the right, looking for anybody. Find Steinmetz, and of course. The extra point attempt, Matheny back in the shotgun. Quick left side pitch, that one goes to Dina. Now Baltimore, first and 10 play. There's a handoff to TC Mesta, trying to find a lane, and that's one knee. This, this is just becoming fun now for Jacksonville. And there's Morgan Spencer going to try the right side. Relatively quick out of the pocket like that, but they need a spark to get back in this ball game. A first and 10 play. There's a pass across. Second and 10. And I'm not sure what happened there. It looked like the safety niche play, and it didn't work. Third and 11 now. Spencer back in the pocket, trying to get away from the rush. And that's Sage. In the shotgun all night. Under center again. There's the handoff of all things. And that goes to T.C. Mesta. And look at the speed. of Matheny trying to send her receiver in motion. A little pitch out played, of course, Sage Steinmetz. And I've played from the Baltimore 14. Another shotgun play to Matheny on the right side pass now. That one to Lauren Ziegler. Ziegler on a little in route right here. Great throw right there. Jacksonville is on a mid. The Baltimore three. Ziegler in motion. Fake handoff to Ziegler. Of course, inside handoff to Steinmetz. And that and she still has the talent to do the worm after she scores. And show for Jacksonville. Shotgun snap to Matheny. Going to try that right side. Quick dump off again. Come up with something to get back in the race for the uh, Eastern Conference. And Morgan Spencer now will go to work with Eason Games. So it does take time to come together as a group. Tempers are starting to... Spencer, second and six. There's the handoff. End around reverse this time to Ali Dickey. And Spencer looking like a quarterback agency. First and goal. Bad snap. And Allie Dickens are under center now. Quarterback draw on the right side. Clock does not stop till we get inside of two minutes. And here is Morgan Spencer. Abs I think Jacksonville is going to work on the clock here. That handoff to Tara Richardson. The Jacksonville breeze. Second and three now. Handoff to Steinmetz. Look out. And that is the only open field tap. 15. Matheny under center, going to take a shot down the right side. And that's Adrian Purnell. Conference. There's another handoff, this time to Steinmetz. A first and goal now from the Baltimore Six. Another handoff to Steinmetz. And she just does absolutely right. Now a first and goal play. That's another handoff. And that was the... That's not going to happen, Mitch. And there's Spencer going to look down the field. No, this is going to be a quick drop. Nobody here on the back of their helmets. Here's Spencer again in the end zone. Another short drop off. Incredible athlete. And there is the final knee. KK Matheny. Dino Jacksonville, the complete opposite. They will play next 